Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am attempting to make a butter chicken recipe that was inspired by a family friend, Alan Money. I will put in his Instagram below if you want to recreate the traditional recipe. Now, I don't eat meat, so my protein of choice will be extra firm tofu. And instead of using heavy cream and yogurt, I am using full fat coconut milk. If you wanna know how this goes please keep on watching and please don't forget to give a like to this video if you really like it and don't forget to subscribe now I'll see you in a bit for your convenience I included the ingredient list here please pause the video and take a screenshot of the ingredient list and measurements as you will be needing this in the future you will need extra firm tofu ginger, garlic, onion, chopped tomatoes, garam masala powder, chili powder, ground coriander, ground cumin, turmeric, dried fenugreek leaves, sugar, full fat coconut milk. I started off by mixing all the marinade spices into the coconut milk as well as the minced ginger and garlic. Then I cut the tofu into bite-sized pieces, placed it on a bowl and poured the marinade all over it and very very gently I mixed everything. I marinated the tofu overnight, which was a mistake because when I went ahead to cook it on a high heat, it was very crumbly and very soft in texture. However, that didn't stop it from smelling and looking good. Moving on to the sauce, on a medium heat pan, I started by sauteing all the spices needed for the sauce for about 10 to 15 seconds until it became fragrant. Right after, I added a roughly chopped onion and cooked it until it became translucent in color. And then I went ahead and added the chopped tomatoes as well as one tablespoon of sugar. Let that simmer for five minutes I let the tomato mixture cool down for 30 minutes and then I went ahead and blended all of that. I poured the sauce right into the same pan and then added one cup of coconut milk, mixed that up and let it simmer for another 30 minutes. I went ahead and added the sauce onto the tofu and as you can already see the tofu was very crumbly so a better option would be to only marinate the tofu for 5 minutes and not overnight or you could use garbanzo beans, they would work great as well. To finish off the recipe, I sprinkled about 1 teaspoon of the dried fenugreek leaves and let it simmer for 5 to 10 minutes. I served this dish with some basmati rice and then garnished it with coriander or cilantro and a wedge of lime. And I also used this um, paratha bread instead of naan and it was very very good. 
Okay guys, we're back. Now, I'm gonna show you. This obviously doesn't look like butter chicken because it's not chicken. Now, the consistency of the tofu is a little, um, it's a little too soft. Now, let's try it. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. It's very tasty. It's it's very tasty. It's really good. <sighs> this is the closest thing to butter chicken I've had. Oh. Mm-hmm. Mm. 